Yeah, what we currently see is also an effect on results of uh, monetary tightening. So it is intended effect. So we see clearly a weak in demand. So we see less incoming orders. The firms also tell us that they see less and less new incoming orders, especially in the industry, manufacturing, but also more and more in the service sector. So a lot of bad news and also sentiments is going down and down uh, in Germany. To what extent is the downturn in sentiment uh, attributable to softness in China, which is obviously so crucial to China's manu- uh, to uh, Germany's manufacturing sector? It is an aspect that contributes to the uh, shrinking sentiment in Germany. So if you take a look at the export uh, manu- exporting firms and manufacturing, we see they have reported us that their export will rather decline than increase in the upcoming months. So China plays a role um, especially for the manufacturing sector and the uh, declining sentiment there. How much of a lasting impact has the pandemic had on businesses? We heard throughout the course of the pandemic and then later on with the energy crisis, many German businesses had to reduce the, the amount of production they were coming out with. But again, if you look at where we are today, we're not fully up to speed. We're not at full capacity utilization. How much of a lasting impact has uh, both of those things done to the German economy? Yeah, good question. So the uh, the impact of the uh, pandemic uh, is getting weaker and weaker. So we had these uh, supply bottlenecks, large problems with supply bottlenecks um, uh, in the last two years. But this problem is easing more, is easing more and more. So this uh, problem vanishes. But on the so we see a shift from supply side problems to demand side problems. So. Um, we could produce more, but now we we are lacking en- uh, enough new orders uh, in German manufacturing. Super interesting and, and wild to think about how dramatically the situation has changed. Um, looking at the breakdown here, the survey looks at manufacturing services, trade and construction. Construction, you use the word continued to nosedive. The construction sector seems like it's in a, a really difficult state and, and things just going from bad to worse. Give us a little bit more color on what's going on there. Yes, yeah, so the, 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 uh, the German construction uh, industry or sector is having a severe recession, especially house building. So we see a strong uh, increase in financing costs and uh, cost of producing or building houses, and that has a dramatic effect on um, demand. So we see a clear nosediving of the, uh, new orders uh, in house uh, housing demand, and we also see a lot of... Um, 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 sorry. So we see that there's a sharp decrease in new orders uh, in construction. And this is a very bad mood uh, uh, in the German construction sector.